Well, good morning, everyone, and thank you for joining us today for our 10th annual Suburban Ramsey County Law Enforcement Memorial Ceremony. Today, we honor the 11 officers who lost, who were lost in the line of duty here in Suburban Ramsey County. Although they all had very different stories and backgrounds, they all served for a purpose and cause far greater than themselves. Richard Crittenden, Sr. I'm just honored to be here and support police departments in the North area here and remembering, you know, Richard Crittenden and the sacrifice that he made for everybody. And I'm just glad that I was able to attend here. I am uh, truly honored, humbled to have been invited to say a few words today. The gravity and significance of this event and this week in the Ramsey County community and across our country is certainly not lost on me. It takes a village to plan and pull off events like this and it's important, I believe, that we gather to reminisce, remember, and retell stories of the law enforcement officers who have made the ultimate sacrifice. Respect the badge. Be grateful for the men and women brave enough to wear it and always remember those who lost their lives protecting us. I'll finish by saying, sadly, these tragic stories continue. In fact, the St. Croix County deputy laid to rest just last Friday was the fourth officer or deputy in a four-week span in the Midwest to be killed in the line of duty. This troubling trend should signal to everyone of the growing dangers America's law enforcement officers face each and every day, and this year is shaping up to be one of the most dangerous for police officers in recent history. As difficult as the process can be, I believe we should share the sorrow and pain publicly. We have to gather. We must remember and grieve as a community, like we're doing today, if there's any hope of making this profession safer, of changing attitudes, laws, and ultimately outcomes. <laughs>